Oh, she's, oh, she slapped Wella. Wella, are you okay? Ryan, what the hell is wrong with you? Stay away from my man. Diamond, are you okay? My cheek is bleeding. What? Hey, everyone. Welcome back. Today, we are back with the next part of More Than Friends. Y'all, we are back with the messiest friend group I have ever seen. I cannot see. Dan, some of these characters are protagonists, might as well be the antagonists, because they be complaining about bullies when they are the biggest bullies themselves. And our girl and her best friend or whatnot, who's really not her best friend, he kind of is terrible. I just, you know what we're going to do? We're going to have some fun with this. I'm going to ruin them. And we are going to just pick options that may not be what the game wants. So we're going to see what happens. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Give it a big thumbs up and hit that like button if you do enjoy it. So I know you want some more episode. Subscribe because why not? And without further ado, let's start the messy drama. Hey, Hoella, what loser? What Shay? Are you asleep yet? I'm trying to be, but you're sitting here talking to us. Of course you're not going to be asleep. We're supposed to be napping so we can stay up all night and party, remember? Totally. <laughs> Are you asleep now? You know what? Fine, I'm up. I can't stand him. But since you've interrupted my beauty sleep, you better entertain me. Hmm. We could finish off what we started. Let's not. What? You only live once, right? Shay, you're driving me crazy. Oh, we're going to drive you crazy, all right, Shay. Don't you worry. Funny, not so long ago you wanted to punch me. Well, why the sudden change of heart? I really wouldn't say it's a change of heart. Actually, just kidding. We did have a change of heart from the last chapter to this chapter. You know why. Just kiss me again. Oh, well, I guess I don't want you mad at me. I don't know which of us kissed there this time. All I knew is I want to be doing to him. Let's not. Maybe I should have pulled away, but I didn't want to pull away. Oh, we're going to pull you away. We're going to yank you away, sister. I have to ask you something. You can ask me anything. Someone told me you kissed Leo tonight. It was a dare. Oh, Amy is acting like, oh my gosh, it was a dare. Like, girl, you have the biggest crush on Leo. Leo out here is supposedly dating our poor girl, Ivory, who's really got the bad end this whole entire story. Do you have feelings for Leo? I'm not gonna lie. I did have feelings for Leo. Do, Star. But he has clearly shown no interest in me. You have shown an interest in me, so I guess I like you. She guesses. Do you feel the same way? Do does this kiss answer your question? I think it does. <laughs> Are you gonna act all sad now? Ivory. I'm going home. Break up with him. Leave that loot. Just, I don't want her when she's single. And as soon as she moves on, I want her. I need to sort my life out. Yeah, you do. Diamond, I need to talk to you. What are you doing? Get out, Leo. Oh my gosh. All right, I think we should get back to the party. Ugh. What? I wish we didn't have to just go yet. Bye-bye, just go downstairs. Come on, let's go downstairs. Fine. <laughs> Bye. Bye, sweaty. Catch you never. Hope you enjoyed that bit of cookie you got because you ain't ever getting it again. Oh, it's getting a little crazy down here. Y'all need to chill. Okay, we're going to go try talking to our good boy Shane over here. Why is everyone... This is what I got out of bed for. Why were you enjoying what we were doing in there? No. Dream on. Not even slightly. No, I didn't enjoy our kiss. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe you. You were totally into me. Oh, you think that, buddy. You think that. Did you enjoy kissing me? How could I not? Really? Because you're going to be stuck with Ryan soon. You're stunning. Thank you. Thank you. Getting to kiss you would make anyone jealous. Why would they be jealous? Everyone is obsessed with you. Stop acting like you did it now. I'm not acting. I don't believe you. Shane told me that everyone is crazy about you, but are afraid to approach you because you're too good for them. I would never think like that about anyone. Okay. I'm not that sort of person. Yes, you are. I know you're not, but they're right. You are too good for every guy in our school. Should we look elsewhere? <laughs> Thanks, I guess. It's like, I want to love our girlie so much, but she treats Ivory so bad. You need to start realizing how beautiful you really are. I love this song. Can I have this dance? Of course. Okay, well, I guess they're gonna have a little dance. 
interesting. I couldn't stop staring into his beautiful eyes. I was mesmerized by them. It felt like there was nobody else in the room but Shay and I. Ryan showed her face at your house tonight. Oh, we saw. I told her to leave. Thank you, Shay. I was so angry at her. Where was the anger? Because I don't remember there being anger. I can't believe she tried to ruin your party. (laughs) He is so fake. But you didn't let her. That means so much to me. You always come first. My heart started a pound. There was definitely something changing between Shanna El Girly. There's going to be something changing soon, all right? This wasn't a friendship anymore. It was something more. Something uncontrollable. And if I'm honest, I didn't want to control what was happening. I need air. Okay. (laughs) This is so corny. Amy, I need to speak to you. Great party, Diamond. I don't have all day. Girl, she is so rude. Come on. I'll be back as soon as possible. Take your time. I want to make a new character and to stunt up to this girl and be like, you need to chill out. What's wrong with you? Everything. Shanna just made out, made out more in my room. What? Yeah, they were having a little messy time up in here. OMG Hawala Diamond. I don't think I can look him in the eyes ever again. You are best friends. I know everything will be fine. And who knows, maybe you two will end up together. Maybe. You really think Shay could like me like that? Um, yes. I've been shipping you guys for years. Leo and I have always thought that Shay has feelings for you. Have you ever thought about what it would be like to be with him? I guess honestly is like, duh. I've secretly been planning our wedding since I was five. In fact, I'm pretty sure we already had a wedding when we were five. This would be really, really cute if this is why I love you. I did not think these people were absolutely awful. What do you think I should do? But I'm about to live for this. Take the risk. Go for it. It's our last year of school and you two belong together. (laughs) If you don't give Shay a chance now, you might regret it forever. You're so right. I should give it a shot. Also, have you ever considered motivational speaking? I love Amy, but a speaker, a motivational speaker, giving advice? Well, it's been a long night. I need some sleep. I'll entertain your guests. You mean you'll entertain Ajax? She literally has slept her whole party away. (laughs) He's one of your guests. Enjoy the rest of your night. Night. Why is she... Just... Where's Diamond? She's gone to bed. Who does that? Don't you dare flirt with any girls tonight. Just because Diamond's gone to bed. I guess you know what happened between us. I do. Don't break her heart, Shay. Yes, ma'am. I'm still, like, in shock like she's going to bed. Oh. Why? Get out of here. She looks so peaceful when she sleeps. Police. Good night, beautiful. Ugh, the next morning. Girl, you should have cleaned up that party. Her mom was going to come in, and her mom and his mom, they were synced. They knew it. They were going to get these little kids. What are you doing in my bed? Why are you shouting this early in the morning? Uh, y'all need a, did you enjoy the party last night? It was the best party this year. People will be talking about it all week in school. Even Shane said to me that it was better than his party. Are you serious? The most popular guy in school tells you that your party was better than his. Does that mean you're popular? No, it doesn't mean I'm popular. It means I held the best party. (laughs) That you didn't get to enjoy. I've got a really good idea. What is it? Ryan must be really annoyed that she wasn't invited to your party last night. Why don't I spread some rumors around the school that you and Shay getting together? It will totally make her mad. I don't, we don't need any more rumors. I don't think you should spread rumors. I don't need any more drama in my life right now. Miss Drama Queen is already up in it. Come on, Diamond. You can't let her push you around forever. I guess the rumors are true. So why not? Then what was the point of the choice? You're the best. I know. You and Leo kissed last night. Did you enjoy it? It was the most awkward kiss ever. This could be the end of Ivory and Leo. Oh, aren't you excited? And the start of Amy and Leo. There will never be a Leo and I. Your matchmaker awaits. Stop! Don't you dare. I'm up for any sort of dare. Girl, you are a terrible person. Fine. I'll leave you and Leo to it. If you want to get with each other, then you will. Maybe, yeah. Did you see Ivory and Leo fight before you and Leo kiss? Aren't you excited? 
Do you know what that was about? I don't even see them fight. Were they loud? Did you catch any of the conversation? No, I wasn't there. Nara saw them fighting, but she didn't hear what the fight was about. Let's hope they're all right, I guess. Not... I knew you weren't the sympathetic type. These are the mean girls. Do you honestly think I want Leo and Ivory's relationship to run smoothly? Definitely not. I'll ask him what the fight was about. He tells me everything. In other stories, these would be the characters I could not stand. I can't stand them. What's happening with you and Ivory? Diamond told me that Nara heard you two fighting last night. Ivory gets aggressive when she drinks. What? Where? I never thought she was going to be crazy. I guess we're all a little crazy. Tell me about it. Diamond is hot and cold with me all the time. <laughs> this, and we're just friends? Yeah, just friends. You never told me why Ivory was angry at you. Okay, you know what, though? As messy as this is, this is, this is the best train wreck. She thinks I like Amy. Do you? No. Why would Ivory think that you like Amy then? Because I didn't take my eyes off Amy all night. That's what Ivory said. Were you looking at Amy at all night? I didn't think I was. But you were. I bet you were. Come on, dude. Tell me the truth. Do you like Amy? No, I don't. I only like her as a friend. I guess. <laughs> Leo, you like her. Don't lie to me. I can tell when you're lying. I do like her. She's the nicest person I know. But I can't go there. She's my best friend and you paid her no attention at all before. Except now, all of a sudden, it's all about Amy. I can't ruin our friendship. Oh, but I can. I won't ruin our friendship. Give it a go. She also hurt me in the past. That's in the past. You shouldn't think like that. Amy will move on if you keep pushing her away. You will lose her for good. I don't want you to make a huge mistake. Thanks, dude. I'm gonna have a long think about everything. Because I like Ivory, too. After kissing Amy last night, I don't think Ivory will forgive you. Dude. Her his face was priceless when you kissed Amy. Ha 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 Diamond didn't make it easy by cheering you two on. Diamond is a legend, bro. Yeah, she is. What was that, Shay? What? You blushed. I hate them. <laughs> I hate them. What are you talking about? How I'm going to ruin all of you people? Shay was telling me about. Shh, okay, pretty little liar. Shut up, Leo. I can make things worse for you. Okay, dude, I'll keep my mouth shut. Once again, we're shut out of the conversation. Oh, wrong person. Whatever. It works. If you must know, we were talking about Ivory and Ryan. Don't bring that name up in my house. Why do you have to annoy her? I was only messing with her. She knows that. You kissed her last night. How'd you feel she brought up another guy after you two making out? I'll sort everything out. We'll have a talk later. Will he ever learn? Will any of you ever learn? You messies. No, he won't. None of you will. I think I'll head home. I've had enough drama for one day. It's the amount of drama they create for themselves. Ooh, it's so juicy. Me too. They are the least self-aware people I've ever seen in a game. Do you want to lift? Yes, please. I'll text Tawella on the way. Uh, you ain't gonna be texting and driving, sis. Leo and I headed home. I'll give you a call later. Thanks for leaving me with Shay. Sorry, you'll be grand, though. Try and sort things out with him. Don't let Ryan win. Oh, she's gonna win. I won't buy. But I love you. Girl, you texting and driving. Look, Leo, I don't want to feel awkward around you after what happened last night. I don't want you to feel awkward around me either. It was a dare. Why would you feel awkward? Fine. I don't want to come between you or Ivory. I know you really like her. I want you to be happy. You are a liar, Amy. You are such a little liar. And here I stand for you at the beginning. And I literally do not. What are you laughing at? I hardly doubt you care about mine and Ivory's relationship. <laughs> I love how they called her out. Even though Leo's messy too. What do you want? I came to apologize for being inconsiderate. It was unfair of me to bring up Ryan, especially after the kiss we shared last night. No shit, Sherlock. I know I'm done sometimes. Sometimes. I don't want you to think last night didn't mean anything to me. It, it meant a lot. Can I take you to breakfast to make it up to you? No. The answer is no. 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 
You're not getting any of that, sister. I'm ruining your life here for fun. <laughs> oh, you can have a little moon, little sweater, all you want. It ain't happening. Will you accept my apology? I didn't accept any of your apologies. Maybe some other time. Uh-uh. Oh, okay. Get down here now. Oh, she's in trouble, you touche. We're dead. Maybe I should have, we better get down there before we're dead. Or maybe I should have cleaned the house up first. See, if you're going to throw the party behind your parents' back, you need to clean up the whole entire house. You got it. You know, and nothing broken. You got to fix everything. Clean it. Make sure it's perfect. And hey, didn't think you'd be back so soon. Care to explain what happened last night? I had a party last night, but you wouldn't even notice because we spent all morning cleaning the house. Shay, what's your excuse for trashing Roxy's house? I thought I brought you up better than this. Okay, well, they spent all morning cleaning. We didn't trash Roxy's gaff. Don't give me back, chat. How many people are at the party? Maybe like six people. Don't lie, young lady. Stay out of it, mom. Oh, he talks to, he talks back to his mom. Oh my gosh, maybe there were like 50 people at the party. I'm so disappointed in the both of you. I bet Amy and Leo had something to do with this. It was my idea. I'm sorry for going against your rules, but the good news is, I had the best part of school's ever had. Diamond, you legend. I will let it go this time. The next time I go away, I will make sure that I get someone to babysit you. Why don't you come over and stop the party, mother? I called Roxy and told her about the party. She told me to leave you all. That we would punish you in the morning. Shay and I are sorry. It won't happen again. We promise. Let's face it. It's going to be hard to beat my party. Uh... I want you to go to your bedroom and study for the rest of the day and night. The same goes for you, Shay. Shay was talking back hardcore to his mama. Get to my house now. I can't right now. My mother has grounded me for the night. Get over to my house now or else. Okay, okay, I'll sneak out. I'll be over soon. Who? Why is he... It's Ryan... What's with the urgent phone call, Ryan? Oh, and he shows up. What happened last night? What do you mean what happened last night? You know what would happen. Diamond had a party. Why don't you answer any of my phone calls or texts? Because it was a party, duh. What's your problem? You're my girlfriend. I can do what I like. Hoella's trying to get with you. Don't you understand? Hoella is my best friend. You won't come between us. Later, crazy. Oh, so now, now he, like, goes off on Ryan. Hello, Diamond. Better watch your back. Oh, she better, all right. <laughs> Monday morning. Girl, fill me in. What did your mother say to you? My mother wasn't even the problem. Shay's mother was angrier at us than my mother. Are you serious? She was trying to... Try, she was saying to Shay, I thought I raised you better. I wish I had been there. No, you don't. My mother brought you and Leah into the conversation. Are you serious? No joke. She was like, I bet Amy and Leo had something to do with this. Don't worry, I put her straight. I have some kissing butt to do. Well, you held a great party on Saturday night. Yeah, it was the best party this year. The next person that holds a party will have hard work to try to beat yours. They definitely have a hard task. Thanks, glad you enjoyed it. No more quiet, Hoella. I wasn't that quiet. What? You are. But it's cute. That's Brad's way of flirting with you. He wasn't flirting with me Saturday night when he was kissing Rebecca. Ooh. Okay, so where is... I want to see Shane. Where's an option with good old Shane? Why isn't he texting me back? Ryan, you'll never guess what I heard off the girls. What did you hear? Shay kissed to Ella Saturday night. What? Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to teach Diamond a lesson. Girl, what are you going to do? How was Spanish? It was pretty boring. I was the only one answering her question, so she kept praising me. Teacher's pet. You have some nerve, Hawala Diamond. Please don't call me by my whole name. You haven't earned that right. To what do I owe this pleasure this time? Don't play dumb with me. You stupid idiot. I'm not... You're just stupid idiot who's ever going to regret the day you ever crossed me. Mark my words, Hawala Diamonds. All right, Ryan, what do you want? I will just want to have a quiet lunch without being annoyed by trash. Me, trash. I'm richer than you two put together, girl. It doesn't matter how much money you have. Like, 
your trash and their trash. It's just the whole, it's the whole garbage disposal unit on the screen. And I'm not finished with you yet. Why the hell did you kiss Shay? You knew Shay and I were dating. First I've heard about you dating officially. First I've heard about you and Shay dating. Especially considering he and I spent seven minutes in heaven at my party. You spiteful little bitch. Oh, she's, oh, she slapped. Wella, Wella, are you okay? Ryan, what the hell is wrong with you? Stay away from my man. Diamond, are you okay? My cheek is bleeding. What? I can't believe you hit her. What has she ever done to you? The friendship I have with you is over. I thought I made myself clear last night. Please, babe. We can sort everything out. Stay well clear of me and my friends. Where was this Shay at the beginning of the story? I don't want anything to do with you ever again. Oh, I'm so sorry this happened to you. What can you expect from Ryan? She's a horrible person. Shay, my face is throbbing. <laughs> we need to get some ice on it before it turns into a bruise. She got slapped. And she's out here bent over acting as if someone literally drop kicked her. Can I take you home and help you get cleaned up? Nah, she's just gonna go home alone. Sucks for you, girl. I'll just walk home. Okay. Bye-bye. Enjoy that bruised cheek. My mother wasn't home from work when I got home, which I was happy about because she's very protective of me since my father passed away. She wouldn't like knowing her kid was attacked at school. <laughs> a fucking day? Did you get home okay? Thanks for checking on me. I'm home. I'll keep checking on you tonight. If that's okay with you. Sure, that's okay with me. Fool, I'd just like to know you're safe. My heart skipped to be this last text. A kiss emoji. Did he mean to send it? This couldn't be love because we're just friends. But if it's not, then why does it feel so much like love? Or maybe it's your cheek throbbing. Okay, so we are done with this chapter of More Than Friends. This messy ass group. Messy. So Leo is still denying about Amy. And then he's like, Ivory's really aggressive when she's drunk. Where, where, where was the aggressiveness? You mean when she was pissed because all you were doing is checking out Amy the entire night? You did spin the bottle and kiss her and were super hype about it. And you've been pretty much ignoring her and paying attention to only Amy for days now. Wow, wonder why Ivory's upset. Then we have Shay as a hot mess. Oh, I can't stand them. And Hoella is miss like victim over everything. And she got like slapped and she's like, it's bleeding. And then she's holding her like her stomach as if Ryan like freaking went in and hit her. This group is so messy. I want to see how this ends because I'm just going to mess up their lives with these options. But let me know what you guys think. I want your opinions. What should I do? Let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed it. But before we go, the shout outs. A big special shout out to Kimmy Loco. I drink red and... Flavia Lacatus, thank you so much for all your love and support. I'm so sorry if I messed up anybody's names, but thank you and thank you to everybody for all your support always. And I hope to see you in the next one and I hope everyone is okay. I'll see you then. Bye everyone. I'm